Hey there, welcome back to the channel. I'm about to start pulling apart this 360 LA and I got the manifold off and I noticed it's got these holes here and I decided, you know, maybe some of the guys that are younger that haven't been in this hobby for terribly long haven't seen this before. What exactly are these holes? Well, these are an emissions control thing that came out in the mid to late 70s called AIR, or air injection. I don't remember what the R stands for, but regardless, it's a it's commonly called a smog pump system. And as is typical on this motor, it's been removed as much as can be removed without doing anything, uh, really modifying the engine. What you'll see is they'll have a pump up here, which is called the smog pump. A metal pipe comes out of it and it comes into usually a canister. It's actually called a diverter valve. That canister has a vacuum signal to it. And then out of that canister, the uh, exhaust, well, the pump from the air pump goes one of two directions. It either goes up into these holes or it gets wasted out down to uh, typically further down in the exhaust or it can be just straight to atmosphere. The idea is when there's vacuum that is low, so under acceleration, it'll inject air here, and that air mixes with the hot combustion gases coming out of the exhaust, and it reburns any hydrocarbons that didn't burn as they uh, were in the combustion chamber. So basically, you get a flame front in the combustion chamber, unburnt uh, hydrocarbons come out, and they're still super hot. So if you inject oxygen right when they're super hot coming out of that exhaust port, then they'll burn. So you end up getting some burn through the exhaust system. It doesn't deliver any power, but it does help reduce emissions. When you're not under power, so when vacuum is high, you don't want to inject air here because it can cause uh, backfire, especially when you're like decelerating. So that's what that diverter valve is for. On some GMs, at least I think it's GMs, I've seen that the pipe system that comes here it basically comes to a manifold itself, and then it's got a tube that runs to each one of these exhaust ports. Mopar went for a different option instead of that. The manifold itself, it has the ports right cast right into it. And then on the end, is where that pipe comes in. Real commonly, since the diver or since the smog pump was removed on this, they also just smashed this closed. They basically broke it off and smashed it over so that exhaust going through here doesn't come out. So if we take a closer look, you can see it's got a hole here on this pad, and this hole is just drilled and it comes out. If you stick your finger up in here, there's a hole uh, that comes out right next to the exhaust valve and again over here so it's kind of angle drilled up in straight through to here heads that are earlier uh, pre-smog basically they just don't have this there was a period of time where there was this boss and it wasn't drilled and then even earlier than that this basically the casting doesn't come down quite this far that's all there is to it thanks for watching